These are by far the most sturdy Tai Chi fans that are really on the market. In this video, I'm gonna be talking all about the blue metal Tai Chi fan we have for sale at Enzo Martial Arts. I'm gonna be talking about all of its features, why you'd wanna buy this, who would train with this, and at the end, I'm gonna to put together a short montage of people training with Tai Chi fans. Hi, my name's Doug Swift. I've been doing martial arts for the past 33 years and I've been the owner of Enzo Martial Arts for the past 16 years. If you're liking this video, click the little icon, subscribe to this channel and get all the latest videos and updates from Enzo Martial Arts. So let's get into this video and learn all about the blue metal Tai Chi fan we have for sale at Enzo Martial Arts. A few years ago now, I did a trip to Wudang Mountain just as a tourist to have a look around. Took a little bit of time out at one of the temples, Purple Cloud Temple, to do a short review of the metal Tai Chi fans that we have for sale at Enzo. It was pretty short, the sound wasn't very good, it wasn't the best place to actually do a video in the end. So I thought it was about time to update that video, give you way more information on the Tai Chi fan so you know exactly what you'll be buying from us. So the name is pretty obvious about what you're gonna be buying. This Tai Chi fan is blue and it has all metal supports all the way down, handles and yeah, and the kind of supports all the way, all the way through. So this is quite a weighty Tai Chi fan. Now it's, a lot of people prefer the bamboo ones because they're a little bit lighter, but actually for Tai Chi, this is really, really sturdy. So these are by far the most sturdy Tai Chi fans that are really on the market. Really, really nice weight, I think. And also having that bit of extra weight gives you a little bit of a workout. The extra weight helps work your muscles a bit, will tell you where you're tense and where you're relaxed. It's just a bit of extra weight over your arms. So it does really help your Tai Chi practice. Really good thing to use. And when you do get onto it in your Tai Chi practice, it's really nice to have a really sturdy, durable, like fan to be able to train with. Now, one of the other benefits of having a metal fan is you can practice partner work if you want. The kind of cheaper, lighter ones are much more for solo practice, whereas these ones you can do a bit of partner practice. And it does exist in Tai Chi where you can do maybe a bit of sort of push hand style training or even just a few like applications, Tai Chi applications. These metal fans are really good for that. And actually they do go over into the Kung Fu and some of the softer internal styles where people are using them a bit more almost as like a, a weapon but more for defense but using these to actually train with and practice applications with and they they end up being like a, a mini baton so for that they're really really good as a solo practice item yeah really really good and really durable now in the old days when I first started the shop all of these little ribs effectively used to have little spikes on them so they had spikes all the way down now this isn't really allowed anymore because it's that would be classed as a concealed weapon because it's hidden within the material they weren't sticking out the top even if they were sticking out the top it's probably probably not very good either but um yeah so all that we can get now are are the flat ribs over the top you can't get the spikes anymore also in the old days when they did have the spikes, it was two layers of material, so it was totally hiding the ribs. Now actually, these would tend to pull on each other a bit, so they would come loose now and again. Not advised, this is very much the standard nowadays with just one bit of material, metal ribs, flat ribs at the top. That's the type, that you're, type of style that you're gonna be getting across the board, really. Now they also have these little plastic additions onto the outside, on both sides. And this really works as quite a good handle. Like the, the metal's not sharp in any way, but just holding metal, especially in class in winter, it can be quite cold, it takes quite a lot of heat out of your hands. So just having those plastic ribs with the design on them, with the dragon design on them, is a really nice little feature to have on the Tai Chi fan. Now also on this, you do get a pattern on it. And this one is a green dragon with some Chinese writing at one end and the green dragon flying through the clouds. Now the designs do change a little bit, so it might not always be possible for us to get the green dragon ones specifically. Sometimes you get a yin yang on them, sometimes it's just Chinese writing. 
So it will change. Now we'll do our absolute best to keep the designs up to date on the website. So it might not be exactly the same as what I'm saying here in the video, but just check out the pictures on the website and that will be the Tai Chi fan that we've got in for sale. If it is different and we haven't updated it, we will do our best to call you if you've bought one online and just to check to make sure that's all right. But in terms of the construction and the material, it'll be exactly the same. Now this material is like a polyester, like a shiny silk style polyester, um, very durable. I haven't actually ever seen them made out of cotton, but cotton just wouldn't be, wouldn't be hardy enough. This is a much harder material. Also, it can coat with getting a little bit wet. So if you are practicing outside and it just starts to rain and it gets a little bit wet, it's not that much of a problem. So more of a problem for the metal, but again, this is stainless, so, so it's very unlikely that it's gonna rust. So that's all the features of the fan. Not much else to say about the features really, that, that's what it is. And then in terms of training, like I said before, it's mainly Tai Chi practitioners. The majority of people doing the fan form or training with the fan are gonna be Tai Chi practitioners. But there are Kung Fu styles that do do them. You do see it occasionally in Shaolin, like in Wudang you see it, which is Tai Chi obviously. Um, but some of the Kung Fu styles, you see it popping up here and there. But the majority of people training with this are gonna be Tai Chi practitioners. Just having a look at the dimensions of the fan. So the length of it is 13 inches or 33 centimeters. Having a look at the weight, it weighs in at 490 grams. So like I said earlier, it's a nice weight. Gives you a bit of feedback on your muscles so you know whether you're doing things right or wrong in your Tai Chi practice. So at Enzo Martial Arts, we like to think we cater for everyone here and we've got the majority of martial arts equipment across the board. Tai Chi is no exception. So as well as the Tai Chi fans, we also have Tai Chi uniforms in the cotton style and the silk style. We do the red oak staffs. We do the rattan bow staffs for those wanting to practice their Fa Jing. We do it with the skin and without. We do the spears. We have a good range of Tai Chi shoes, including the rubber sole, the very popular cotton sole, and for outdoor use, the Fei Yu shoes. We have a wide range of Tai Chi straight swords, including the wooden Tai Chi sword and the aluminium Tai Chi sword. So as promised at the beginning of the video, here is a short montage of people training the Tai Chi fan. Thanks very much for watching, I hope it was useful, I hope you learned loads about the blue metal Tai Chi fan we have for sale at Enzo. If you like this video, click the little icon, subscribe to this channel and get all the latest videos and updates from Enzo Martial Arts. Thanks very much and I'll see you soon. Cheers!